Hi, this is Julie Thompson reporting from IAB's annual leadership meeting in Miami Beach with the famous Anne Blinkhorn of Blinkhorn LLC. LLC. <laughs> Hi, Anne. Hi there. Anne is the premier executive recruiter for the entire business, so we thought it would be interesting to talk to you about talent. Well, all I can tell you, Julie, is that my entire firm focuses on senior level search at the intersection of media and technology, and guess what? Every senior leader in the industry is here in Miami for the IAB annual leadership meeting. So I really, my job is done. You're done. I'm done. It's like one-stop shopping. It's one-stop shopping here in Miami. So thank you for including me. Excellent. Well, you must be very busy, because what, what sector of the industry is hotter than this? This is really, this is the challenge, is that there really is a small supply of executives, even though there are 850 people here tonight and for the, 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 the leadership meeting, the fact of the matter is there are far greater numbers of requirements out there at a senior level, and that's really the, the challenge, is finding the talent. It's a, it's a small talent pool. Yeah, well, I'm sure at the very top, but also in mid and entry level. Absolutely. I mean, digital ad sales people are, you know, to go into that right out of college, I keep telling my nieces and nephews. Absolutely. You and it, you may have noticed that when there were three honorees this evening for Sales Leader of the Year, yeah, I could see all of the uh, sales managers in the room scribbling notes down. I've got to call, you know, one of these three for my my next recruiting mission. So no, there's there's there is a real talent gap, and that's what our firm focuses on is filling the gap. Wow. So you so the networking here for you must be amazing. How do you do it's it? It's terrific. No, it, it's you know it's not easy. I mean I. I, you know, I try to actually arrange meetings before I get here. That's kind of, you know, sales 101 is figuring out who's available when and, and making sure to find time in between sessions. But it's just, it's a very, very productive couple of days. And, um, and it's also a lot of fun. That's great. How long have you been in the business? I've been in the business since 2002 as a recruiter. But prior to that, I had the pleasure of working as a an um, executive with the New York Times company. So I worked with Martin Nissenholtz, who was honored this evening. Um, and um, so having had that experience really helps me in my work because I can really uh, relate to the hiring executives' needs and issues. It's a, it's a, it's, um, it's a, it's a background that, I, that has been very, very useful to me. Excellent. So, so what's the number one thing that your clients are asking for in executives these days? I would say um, that even though this is a, a term that's used all the time, it's leadership. And for example, you know, I'm working on a chief revenue officer search right now, and my client has told me it's not the number of years of experience, it's really the ability to bring together and mobilize a team and provide true leadership. It's not easy to find. Um, and that's, that's really probably the biggest challenge and the biggest requirement is leadership in any of the functions that we do searches in. Yeah, and, and do you think true leadership can be taught? I think that I'm, I'm a big believer in coaching and I think that, um, and a big believer in developing people. And so I do, I do think that leadership can be learned over time. Um, I think there are certain people for whom it's a lot easier, um, but I do think it's coachable. Excellent. Well, on that note, thank you so much for being here, and, and happy hunting. <laughs> Thanks so much. Pleasure talking to you.